Wallace Monument. I had no idea that even existed. I mean, I knew who William Wallace was and what he stood for. The scale of it. Free was if you're interested. I have done so much cardio on this Scotland adventure. I think the steep hill up to this monument takes the biscuit. Oh, yes. Oh, oh. My goodness, this is absolutely preposterously magnificent. Why that door is 12 foot high and I have no idea how big that is. It's 150 feet straight up on top of a very tall hill. Oh yeah. And from the Abbey Craig viewpoint, you can of course see all of Stirling and why they call it the gateway to the Highlands. Our kid Bry knows all about zooming into a misty sunset. Oh my gosh. Oh. It's Loch Lomond that way. Trossachs. One day, a giant sandal with a sock in it will be assembled out of 200 feet of stone to commemorate the most epic van life channel and one of the least successful on YouTube. The Wallace Monument Shuttle Bus. A 2020 long wheelbase transit custom. A man can dream, can't he? What a magnificent monument to a Scottish hero.
G underscore B just sent me some dosh for a takeaway and a pint. I'm not sure if I'll drink the pint, but uh, yeah, it could be two evenings food there. Although I am stuffed today after that um, roadside microwave chicken um, madras curry with rice. Oh yeah. So I'm in for another yomp up now, <laughs> up another hill, to look at Stirling Castle. While I go on my walkabouts, I never <laughs> make a mental note of where the van is, but I seem to always find my way back. Some days are harder than others. There's the Wallace Monument on Abbey Craig across the valley. Epic. Turns out there's a road up here with a great big car park right next to Stirling Castle. Oh yeah. Grand. Who are you? It is King Robert the Bruce, June 24th, 1314. 1314. I had no idea Robert the Bruce was that long ago. All of these parking cat size are illuminated and they flicker. Well, perhaps that kind of stuff's more interesting to me. <laughs> And it looks like there's an old citadel just outside the castle walls. I think there's enough light to pick it up on my camera at night. really unusual to have this much light at night. What good timing for the ambiance. Oh my goodness, this old city goes on. I had no idea, Sterling. You can tell there were masons here because the stonework is exquisite everywhere. See if I can take a picture of all that. If you liked my film of Dolgethly, 
not the cat cuddling one, the uh, look around the buildings, then Sterling is, I mean, whoa, whoa, I mean, if you're into photography, architecture, history, it's just all here. <laughs> the Masonic Lodge. <laughs> As ever, I got completely carried away with my walking tour. And now I'm as lost as a carrot. <laughs> I think I know where I am. Nothing shall be forgotten. Whoa. Check out the uh, worse than Halfords hazard lights. Oh dear. Nah. You know, the trick to vehicle modification is knowing when to stop. Yes, I was parked behind that Spanish camper van. See? I told you I wasn't lost. <laughs>